Hi everyone, my name is Alex. Today I'm going to be trying the Glow Recipe Pomegranate Peptide Firming Serum. This product retails for $45. I'm excited because this is another launch from the brand Glow Recipe. I've tried so many of their products on this channel and I love a lot of them. Now I always preface all of my peptide reviews by saying I am not the best person to testify for anti-aging benefits, but Glow Recipe has said that this product does cover a lot of skin concerns. I'm glad that brands are starting to advertise their peptide serums for all ages because peptides are not just good for anti-aging. That is what they're often used for, but they are also good to clear up acne and work to rebuild your skin barrier. And that's what I personally am looking for. But if you are looking for a more anti-aging review, I'm definitely not the best creator for that. So please check out another creator that is more targeted for that. The things that I will be looking for with this product are specific to my skin concerns. And so just keep that in mind when going into this review. This product is vegan, cruelty-free, alcohol-free, and comes in recyclable packaging. They do have some fragrance in this, so just keep that in mind before you purchase this product. The highlight ingredients in this product include polypeptides, pomegranate seed oil, and hyaluronic acid. To check out the full ingredient list, make sure you click the link in the description to go to their website. Peptide serums often take a long time to show results, and so I won't be looking for any notable results, but I do still want to see how this product performs, how it feels on the skin, and something a little bit unique to this product is I want to see how it compares to some of the more affordable peptide serums because I do know of a few that are really affordable compared to this product, especially for how much you get. Glow Recipe does put a cocktail of amazing ingredients in their products, but I will still be wanting to see what it does for my skin to see if I personally feel like it is worth it. As for anything else, I will be continuing to do check-ins, so I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone, I'm here to give you all a quick check-in on this product. Product. I have been using this product for about four days. Obviously, I haven't seen any notable results with my skin, but it has been looking very bouncy and it seems to have been helping to clear up some of my breakouts that I was having. I love peptide serums because they do so many things for the skin and they are not just for anti-aging, they are also for acne and just your skin's overall appearance. This product though is pretty expensive for the amount that you get, but I don't find myself having to use more than one pump of this product. I know that Glow Recipe has some other ingredients in here that separate it from other serums on the market, but I have a peptide serum that I love, which is the COSRX peptide serum. And so I'm gonna be really hypercritical on this product because it is so expensive. Now, the texture is very nice and very luxurious. It's very light but it is a little bit of a thicker peptide serum from some of the other ones that I've seen. It is so moisturizing and so luxurious, but the fragrance is definitely there and it is kind of potent in this product. I only take one pump and it goes all over my face. And you can see there, it does give a nice glow to the skin, but it is not terribly hydrating. It's more of a hydration enhancer from what I can tell so far. I do know of a cheaper alternative to this product, but I'm just going to continue using it and seeing how it performs. And then I will be able to see how I feel like this product is. I'll continue using it and I'll check in again. So I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone. I'm back to give you all my final thoughts on this product. Obviously I didn't use this product for a very long time, so I'm only getting a first impression with it, but my skin has been looking pretty pretty good recently. It definitely hasn't caused any acne and it also didn't irritate my skin in any way. It seemed to be showing some similar results that I've seen with other peptide serums. I really didn't find anything wrong with this product, but it is a very expensive product for how much you get. And the reason I am comparing this to another product is because I know a cheaper alternative that you do get a ton more with. The COSRX peptide serum is my absolute favorite peptide serum, and I saw very similar results between this product and that product. The only reason I would recommend this product over that one is if you look at the ingredients and it's something that you do want to invest more into. No judgment whatsoever with that, but as for me repurchasing, I will be repurchasing the COSRX over this product. I didn't see anything wrong with this product, and my skin has been looking really good recently. It's just very similar results to the COSRX. This product also 
also was a little bit more moisturizing. That product was a little bit more lightweight and liquidy. This product had a little bit more of a luxurious feel and it definitely felt like a more moisturizing peptide serum. So if you do need that extra level of hydration and you are willing to pay that extra price point, I didn't see myself going through this product very quickly. It is a good product. It's just a very expensive price point. And when it comes to me purchasing skincare, I do prefer to go for more affordable skincare and you get so much of the Cosfer X for $26 when this product is pretty expensive for one fluid ounce. That's why I would repurchase the CosRx over this one. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more like this, make sure you subscribe because I post new videos every week and I will see you all in the next review.